Yeah, in general, the world is full of much secular humanism, but it's not going to be this way forever. It's just not. Um, people are tired of it. People want God, and it's going to happen, okay? People are finding God like crazy. They're getting filled with the Holy Ghost like crazy. They're seeking Christ like never before. They're reading their Bible and digging deep into the languages and getting answers and all this cool stuff. Um, and businesses are closing. Like, just environments that were toxic and, you know, uh, you know, dumb, just dumb bars and restaurants where it was just trashy music, second music. It's a lot of, you're just going to see a lot of freedom. Um, healthy eating is a massive thing that's going to take over. That's a massive movement that is coming, like very big. Um, you're just going to see a, uh, well, I could get into details, but, um, oh yeah, a, a huge revival is coming. A huge awakening, especially to the personal voice of God, to every human is coming. People are going to understand that and that God wants to talk to them in their heads all day long, okay? And there's going to be a holiness movement. The first thing that happens in every revival is people get struck by the holiness of God, okay? And his, and his demands for holiness and reverence in every building and place there is, okay? It's called the Jesus cleanup. You know, if there's anything in your life, building, or home uh, that does not that does not please God Himself walking in and seeing, God will convict you, and you'll have the power to just get it out. Just totally get it out. Okay, um, it's very simple to do. Um, God gives you the power and the discernment to do it, um, and you just plain do it for your higher happiness and blessing. It's that simple, but it begins uh, with an awakening. It begins with the quickening of people's minds, hearts, and spirits uh, that God is real and that God is perfectly 100% holy, okay? And he has standards of right and wrong and what pleases him and what doesn't. Um, and the first thing that happens when people get quickened by the Holy Spirit is he gives them discernment. Okay, as to what is pleasing to God and what is not. And that is where you will see the cleanup of the world, okay? When people get filled with the Holy Ghost, his name is called the Holy Ghost because he is holy. <laughs> and you will see discernment and conviction fill people like never before, okay? And... It's also called the fear of the Lord, okay, uh, and the power of the Holy Ghost uh, to identify things in this universe that displease the Most High God, grab a hold of them by the neck, pin them against the wall, and throw them out of the building. That's exactly what's going to happen. You're going to see men and women alike getting ruthless with sin in their life and anything that is displeasing to the Lord, and they're going to have the power to get rid of it permanently in their life.